Finally tonight, long after audiences leave London's famed Royal Albert Hall, a young accomplished organist is still thrilling hundreds of thousands of fans and winning over classical newcomers on TikTok. CBS's Ian Lee shares what led to her meteoric rise to stardom. There's magic after midnight at the Royal Albert Hall. In its vastness of empty seats sits a solitary figure commanding the hall's great organ. It's like this hidden world that people don't even sort of know exist yeah. while they're asleep in bed. Anna Lapwood harnesses the power of the instrument made up of 9,999 pipes. She's practicing in these dark hours, the only time the hall's not booked. And while it appears empty, the world is watching on social media. Lapwood's phone capturing each moment. I have just finished my practice session at the Royal Albert Hall. What do you love about the work? Oh my gosh, it's the only instrument where you're playing a building. The whole building resonates with the organ. It shakes the foundations. But before Anna took off on social media, she became the youngest ever director of music at Pembroke College in Cambridge. Her students turned this midnight maestro onto TikTok. How did you become so viral? It happened totally organically with um, this collaboration with Bonobo that happened a couple of months into the residency. British musician Bonobo heard her play and a collaboration was born, electrifying fans and the music world. I feel like it's blown my musical world so wide open. I was suddenly there with 5,000 screaming fans, screaming for the organ, which I've never had before. What did you feel in that moment? Oh my gosh, it was like ecstasy. I couldn't stop my, and even now I get goosebumps just thinking about it. And a laugh on the organ makes some noise. Even Andrew Lloyd Webber took note. It is 5.30 in the morning. I'm in the Albert Hall with one cleaner and I'm about to scare the living daylight out of them by playing Phantom of the Opera as loud as I can. So classical can be cool. It can be cool and it, it is cool. It is cool. Breathing new life and some coolness through these classic pipes. Ian Lee, CBS News at the Royal Albert Hall in London.